At least $800,000 worth of damage from the recent storm. Saratoga declaring a state of emergency last week and now due to the danger of more falling trees, city officials have closed one of its most popular parks. KTV South Bay reporter LaMonica Peters live tonight in Saratoga with more on the story. LaMonica. I'm at Wildwood Park, and though the rain has slowed down here, Tuesday's storm caused more trees to fall, and now the city has decided to close this park. They're asking people to stay away until further notice. There was a huge chunk of the uh, eucalyptus tree that fell. I took a picture of it and sent it to my, uh, my family. They were like all surprised because it was such a huge thing. In a city known for its beautiful trees, Saratoga has been hit hard by downed trees during the recent storms. This is what it looked like two weeks ago when a huge eucalyptus tree came crashing down on Allendale Avenue and Harley Drive. Now Wildwood Park is closed after this large tree fell Tuesday. We love the, uh, the park. We come here very often. So because the weather, because of tree falling down, we feel very unsafe to come back. So yeah, I think we need another good management about the trees. The city says declaring a state of emergency makes it easier to request resources, financial assistance, and to get reimbursement through FEMA. Saratoga had already estimated $350,000 in storm damages from December and January, but this week the city allocated an additional $450,000 to cover damages from the most recent storms. Well, I think for all those trees, maybe we need to cut down some of them. I know it's a big loss, but since it's uh, threatening the people's life, I think we should reconsider about it. Just last week, fallen trees killed five people across the Bay Area during a series of atmospheric river storms. It's kind of sad to see um, all this rain and uh, people uh, dying. Um, that's very unfortunate. I feel really sorry for the families. A city spokesperson says it's too early to tell how much it'll cost to repair the damages here at Wildwood Park, but they estimate that the damages for the entire city could be close to $1 million. Mike? A winter season that just does not want to come to an end. All right, LaMonica, thank you for that. U.S.